Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we will see one more common USQL job processing that of filtering your data. So you can filter your data to remove unnecessary records and again there are three steps to it. The first one is again the same and even the last one is the same. First one is the extraction, the last one is the outputting. And the second stage is you would filter the data using a WHERE clause similar to SQL language. And in the WHERE clause, you can use the power of C sharp language to use any of the different C sharp functions, which we will look at in the demo. So I already have prepared a new SQL script. So let me just go and copy paste that. And let me give some space so that you are able to see the different stages of this job execution and the job name let me rename it as filter data and if you see this job goes through three steps the first step it basically extracts the data from uh, this vendor folder and the second step it takes the add data variable and applies a filter condition so it takes the entire record which is stored in this variable called a and it applies the c sharp function called substring so it checks whether the first character of any line is an ash if it is an ash it is ignoring it and i have shown you the data and in the data set we had first two lines as commented outlines and those commented outlines are identified by this particular function so we do not want to have any commented outlines so it is removing that and once it removes i am basically getting um, the output within the results.txt and results.txt is already created so what this will this code will do is it will just go and replace that file and I will set the AUS to 8 and submit the job after some time the job is successful so let me go into my data and outputs and see the results and you see we receive all the different records within that file except the first two records because of that C sharp function thank you